my dear sisters and brothers, although our skins may be different colors, we may speak different languages and subscribe to different cultures and religions, we are members of one family, the human family, God's family. We are born for goodness, for love and interdependence. None superior, none inferior. God carries all. Yet terrorism has become a word familiar even to innocent children. Indeed, in West Africa, terrorists specifically target children. Many of us have heard of Boko Haram's cruelty, the innocent lives taken, girl children kidnapped, families rendered homeless and destitute in their own lands, stripped of hope, freedom and dignity. We have seen on our television screens the anguish of parents uprooted and robbed of their most precious possessions. Their anguish is our anguish and God's anguish, the mother and father's pain. Yet the authors of all our anxiety are members of our family too, born in innocence for goodness and love. Human beings have unique gifts to reason, reconcile, restore and repair, to resolve what may appear irresolvable. I am proud to be the patron of Empower 54, which rehabilitates internally displaced women and children in Nigeria by supporting the women to become self-sufficient and establishing schools for their children. Princess Mudupi, Ozolua and her Empower 54 team are enabling survivors of terrorism to regain independence and rekindle their faith in humanity. I therefore wholeheartedly support their Rise Above Terror campaign and ask you to do the same. God bless you.